Silk is a fine, delicate, soft and a beautiful substance. This miraculous fiber is also considered to be pure and holy. Fortunately Indian silk industry has secured its second position contributing 18% to the world's total silk production. This documentary is a walkthrough of the production of silk, an ancient luxury good. Our journey to silk started from the silk city Ramanaga. It is the land of seven hills and a trekking paradise for explorers. Well known for its temples, caves, hills, rivers, agriculture, cattle rearing and mainly for its sericulture. A small town less affected by urbanization, except for the chaos caused by State Highway 17. Though there are a wide range of silkworms, Bombix Maori is the one used widely. A female silk moth lays up to 400 eggs and probably dies. These moths as well as the eggs are protected under controlled temperature and the eggs are disinfected. Each egg hatches into larvae. These larvae are fed with mulberry leaves. Namme sir Krishna pa. Now we sumaru on the Patustinda Resme Bereda Dib. Chaki Sakani Kindrinda now Chaki Takabundo. Adana Ili Nama stand to Gorge Haki Adana Tiruagi Murti. Tiruagi Murgi Adu Jordin the Jerke Bundaga Adna Idmar Bundu Nalpne Jordin the Idi Sika of the Sikh and Mangali Gura and Agate Adana Chendrike will put you Chendrike in the Puna Idi the Sikh good Tegiti. Tugudanantara now market cake good Maratake, Tonal Market. They are the voracious eaters and these fussy eaters grow up to at least 3 inches. Once they are done feeding, they are transferred into the Chandragi, a circular bamboo mount traditionally used for the silkworm to build their cocoon. Silkworm secretes a sticky liquid protein from their two salivary glands. While constructing the cocoon, silkworm twists in a figure eight motion about several times and produces around one kilometer of continuous filament. These cozy cocoons are collected from the bamboo mounts and then they are cleaned. You got bled Chanaka, I tell you. You can't put that there. Waste it, you can't put that there. You can't put that there. You can't put that there. करता है कमाल आता है जाता है खाली वतना है गवर्नमेंट से कुछ नहीं हमना सोलत नहीं है 
ना फिर बारिश में भी ढो नाफे ढोना इधर धूप में भी नाफे ढोना और परेशानी ज़्यादा है और यहाँ कुली ले लग गई थी भी तीन दिन को चार दिन को पाँच दिन को हम ना कुली मिलता है एक महीने को मिलता है ठीक है बोले तो परमानेंट नाफे ढोते हैं नाम है कुली मिलता है इसमें रोजी रोटी हमें कमा लेके खा ले जाते हैं यहाँ हम ना कोई गाँव वाला तो किधर वाला कुछ नहीं है हम ना एक अस्पताल है न कुछ है न क्या भी नहीं है यहाँ कमाना है खा लेना है चल जाना है भले बता These cocoons from the market are taken to the next stage of production, silk reeling. I'm Muhammad Bashir, and for 25 years I've been working here. are allowed to hatch it destroys the silk filament so they are immersed in boiling water this also allows to unravel the cocoon without breaking the fiber the cocoons are then placed in the reeling machine where the fiber from a number of cocoons are weaved into one single thread. ले लेके जाके उधर बंडे पर डाल के सुखा के तेल डाल के तेल बना के वो वेस्ट क्या कि केमिकल बनाता है तो वो वेस्ट है ना ये बंडल बन के बाहर के मतलब पूजा पाए तागा बनता है वो भी बनता है हाँ ये जी पांच सौ रुपए कौन सा भी वेस्ट 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 नहीं होता है थोड़ा सा भी वेस्ट नहीं होता Later these threads are twisted again and tied to form separate bundles. These fine thread bundles are later colored as per the requirement before weaving. the last stage of silk production. Silk threads are suspended in various directions and the machine is moved up and down where each movement weaves each strands of the sari. Punch cards are loaded in the machine to create designs on the series. A plentitude of hard work and dedication is involved in the production of this mesmerizing good. Let the love for silk sari among the Indian women remain ceaseless.